Hi, this is Robin Duncan with the Miracle Center of California, and this is EFT for Emergencies. And today our topic is on self-acceptance and worthiness. Take a moment now to tune in to the areas where you are really judging yourself. This might be about how you see yourself. It might be about your body or your weight or the way that you conduct yourself. It might be about your education or perhaps feeling like you have fallen short on meeting your own expectations or the expectations of someone else. Perhaps it's about your income or the way that you live. Uh, perhaps it's about your belief system. Somewhere in your mind, you can probably find at least one area where you feel that you have fallen short and that this has cost you and it has become a barrier to your own peace, your happiness, and maybe even your abundance. In A Course in Miracles, it teaches us that when we deny ourselves, we are actually denying our Creator, because we are created by the Creator. So to the degree that you are denying yourself, meaning that you are allowing yourself to be judged even by you, then you will inadvertently bring in some form of punishment or uh, misery in your life. And really, there is no need to suffer for any reason. So today let's give up our need to suffer and let's turn back to what's true about you. Take a moment now to focus on the area where you are most judgmental, most harsh about yourself. Take a moment and tune into it. And once you have that, let's go ahead and start tapping over the heart just like this. And repeat after me, even though I have this self-judgment and sometimes I'm very harsh on myself. I am willing to release this judgment because I'm recognizing this is a barrier to my peace, my joy, and my abundance, maybe even my health. Let's go to the other side of the chest. I am willing to see myself differently, even if I never have, even if I think it's impossible. Today, I am willing to move beyond impossibility. I call upon the Holy Spirit to help me with this, to clear my mind, and to accept myself without judgment. Let's go to the top of the head now. I release all self-judgment. I release my criticisms. The places in my mind where I think I am not enough or I'm not doing enough or I haven't accomplished enough. I recognize today these are barriers to my peace. And when I deny myself, I am denying God. I am willing to stop doing that. Let's go to the eyebrow point. I release all self-judgment. I release all areas where I am holding myself hostage, where I am expecting too much, or I'm pushing too hard. I'm willing to accept myself just as I am, side of the eye, as I accept the truth of who I am, that I am whole, I am complete, just as God created me. I create a space for healing and miracles to be accomplished in my life. Let's go on to the cheek spot here. I accept the goodness within me. I am willing to release my judgments and to allow the wholeness of who I am to be shown to me. Under the nose, I am willing to move past all of my judgments I'm allowing my life 
to be transformed. I'm willing to know. I am worthy of a happy life in all respects. Let's take a moment, take a deep breath in and exhale. Take another deep breath in, exhale. Go ahead and tune in now to those remaining judgments. Let's say it's about the way that you look, that there's some aspect of yourself that you're not happy with, something that when you look into the mirror, it just keeps you from accepting who you are and even from enjoying your day. And let's release this together. Going back over the heart. If there is any area where I am judging myself, holding myself harshly in judgment, I'm willing to release it. My desire for happiness and peace is greater than my desire to hold myself in judgment. Let's go to the top of the head. I am willing to call upon the highest part of my mind, the Holy Spirit, God itself, I am willing to call upon this place of wisdom to help me with this. On the eyebrow point, one finger on the inside of each eyebrow, I turn all of this over and I will leave a space for all of my thoughts about myself to be healed and transformed. Let's go to the side of the eye. I am willing to borrow the certainty of my own Creator that I am whole, complete, and worthy of a happy life, abundance, joy, and health in all respects. Let's go under the other, other eye here. I accept myself exactly as I am. I am willing to see myself differently and allow the truth to shine through so that all of my judgments would be undone. Let's take a big deep breath. Exhale. One more deep breath. And exhale. Let's finish with this prayer. Because as we create this space for our higher mind to intervene, you see our higher mind is the place of our divine wisdom and intelligence, the place without fear or judgment. And as we offer this place in our mind to be turned over, all of our thoughts and judgments can be healed, which releases all of our barriers to peace and joy and happiness and health and abundance. Let's do that today together. Dear God, I thank you for this time of release and with your strength and guidance, I am willing to trust that you have a plan for my happiness and that if I will not decide against you any longer, that you can show me that plan. Today, I am willing to accept myself without judgment the best that I know how. I am willing to offer that space to you to be used for you to teach me about the happiness that is your will for me. I will listen for your voice and I will follow everything that feels peaceful and compelling and I will know I am listening to your voice. Amen.